How to roach a horse's mane. There are plenty of reasons to roach or hog a horse's mane. Disciplines like polo consider a roached mane the gold standard of mane care. Your horse may also have a medical condition that makes a roached mane a necessity for monitoring and medicating the area. The mane may be wildly thick and hot for the climate you live in, or you might just like the style. As with all things clipping, start with a clean and conditioned mane. In the summer, a shampoo bath is fine. In the winter, it's a bit more challenging. I start by using a dry shampoo on a damp cloth to lift any dirt from the mane. This does take a bit of time. You want to focus on the hair closest to the horse where the clippers will travel. Then come back with a grooming oil and a rag or a sheen product to condition the hair and create a slick surface for the clippers to glide through. Use clean clippers with fresh and sharp blades. Use clipper oil before you start and every five minutes as you are clipping. If this is the first time you are roaching, lift a section of the mane in one hand and remove most of the length. You can fine tune things later. If you are doing a touch up, start to glide your clippers over the top of the mane. On thin and wispy manes, this is really easy. On thicker manes like this one, I work in sections making lots of passes over the mane. I'll also vary the angle of the clipper so that the sides and the top each get some attention. I don't recommend clipping all the way down. This creates a stripe of exposed skin that can cause sunburn. Leaving a little bit of hair gives the horse some sun protection and you can do some fine tuning to the style. If you are showing or doing a clinic, do this a week or so in advance. Any sharper edges will start to soften as things start to even out.